So it is, let's see, 5.18 in the morning on uh, Wednesday. Get ready for plane ride trip. Uh, not awake. I'm not awake. So we got a 8 o'clock flight this morning. Goes to Charlotte. Oh, it's so dark. Goes to Charlotte, North Carolina. And then we get a connecting flight from Charlotte to Tri Cities, Tennessee. And from there, my mother will be picking us up, and it'll be about an hour, hour and a half ride to my grandmother's house up in the mountains of Virginia. Go get some nice mountain air. Uh, and this will be Connor's third plane ride. If uh, we did a trip out to Chicago in May, I believe it was. And he was probably the best infant you could possibly imagine for flying. Even We even got compliments from people about how well he flew. That he wasn't fussy, that he wasn't, you know, he wasn't one of those typical infants that people see come on the plane and go, oh crap, there's a baby on the plane. So hopefully he sticks with that and is still great with flying. Uh, the first flight shouldn't be too bad. The one I'm worried about is the second flight because it's a small prop plane. Tri City is a small airport. It's actually one of those airports that's so small that there's no skywalk or whatever they call it that comes up to the plane. You actually get off the plane on the tarmac by the, the doors and walk in and uh, grab your bags as you walk in type of thing so it, it'll be a different experience for stuff indeed I've been there a couple of more than a couple a few times and uh, it's an it's it's interesting if you haven't been through there so stuff's gonna have a, a fun time with that and, uh, and not that it's you know a fun time as in it's gonna be tough or hard or Something she's not gonna like. It's gonna be fun. Fun, 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 fun. Someone's a little excited about what's going on outside. Yeah, he's just staring out the window. He was like, oh, what is it? <laughs> We're moving. And then he sees the lady with the, with the Hey, ladies and gentlemen, once again, welcome aboard. Your safety is important to us. At this time, we'd like for you to please pause for a moment and give your. Yeah. in Tri-Cities, Tennessee. Bluntful. Uh, not, what, what's, what's the official name of the, well, the town? Well, the town, it's in, it's Bluntville, Tennessee. Bluntville, B-L-O-U-N-T-V-I-L-L-E. -L -L -E. But locally it's called, instead of Bluntville, it's, it, locally it's Bluntville, Tennessee, which is near, between Bristol and Kingsport. And I use her as an example because she just told me that I talk too much in these things. <laughs> that Steph and I both talk too much. And guess it well, it takes one to know one. <laughs> <laughs> 
Uh, now you know where I get it from. But we got here. It was a bit hectic. We uh, made the first flight, no problem. Providence to Charlotte. But the... Um, As usual, mm, Charlotte was a problem. No, well, <laughs> it wasn't Charlotte that was the problem. It was me. When we got to Charlotte, I misread the ticket. Thought that boarding started at 11.25. It actually started at 10.55. So we were sitting in Burger King, and I finally heard something about Tri-Cities, and went to the board and looked and looked at my ticket and went oh, bleep. what the <laughs> bleep <laughs> so we ran up there but it was already packed and closed and you know so if we we were scheduled for an hour later thankfully and now here we are Amen. thank you lord and there's the sleepy tired hungry wife and then he he has been the Here's best little that. traveler. Want water. Thankfully, even yeah. though he's been a little, he's been so tired and he, he took a nap. But as you can tell, he's not his usual all over the place self. He took a nap for most of the second trip, which wasn't that long. That that was what only thirty five minutes long. That's what the that's what yeah the. Ticket says that the plane ride was supposed to take an hour. We get on the plane and the captain says, 30 minutes. It's only supposed to be 35 minutes. Yeah, that's oh, my. Right. It's just like that. <laughs> it's just like that. <laughs> so, thankfully, I took a nap off and on. I was dozing in and out, and he took a little nap. And thankfully, because he, we had to wake him up early in the morning. It, oh, probably in about an hour before he would have woken up. But you know it sucks to yeah, still wake him up. Twice oh, that's last right. Night. Yeah, he woke up For twice last hours. night. He was doing really well. Thankfully, he got complimented just like the last time we. Uh, I think I actually mentioned it this morning about how he was complimented last time he we went to uh, Chicago. Now, after feeling like crap the entire ride, I got, got, kind of got the cold sweats. You could tell that he just did not look good. Okay. In order food. So we're back. On the road again after getting food. And now okay, Connor's upset because he wants. Yeah, you guys. Construction, it's everywhere. Yuck. Sweet tea, yuck. yuck. As you can tell, my mom does not like sweet tea. But she forgot that this is the South. Being a Please Southerner, say. she's the only one in the South who doesn't like sweet tea. So you did say iced tea, not sweet tea. That's exact. Well, uh, it's iced a tea given. in the South is. It's a given. Sweet tea. It is just, you know. Um. How it is. It's just how it is in the south. Yeah, that was not a southern accent whatsoever. You want to fry? I want to fry. Uh, yeah. So, if you guys start hearing me with trying to do a southern accent, it's not me trying, it just happens. It's like when my mom comes back down. <laughs> it just happens. Instead of saying I, I say ah. It's in the blood. Oh, crud. So, as I was saying, we missed a flight. We got to know an hour later. Thankfully, all our bags got over here. Uh, Connor slept on the second flight, which is good. And uh, now we're on the way to Wise, Virginia. Well, you get the Wise right. Wise. Virgin it's not Ver, it's the Virginia, but, not Norfolk. Virginia. Virginia. Yeah, just don't say the mountain range around here because you might likely to say it wrong. Appalachian. There you go. That, now you know how to say it. Named after the Apalachicola Indians. It's not the Apalachicola Indians, it's History the Apalachicola lesson. Indians. Now I'll be quiet. Yeah. Time to eat. Ah.